Just want to give you some idea how we position dialogue. So with dialogue, obviously we're talking about humans. So we'll start with this kind of human figure here. And then what we will um, begin to think about is, well, how do humans think? And as we know, in the past history, they colonize, they speak dogma, they preach, they teach and as the word count gets lower they begin to talk and eventually they might begin to listen and then if they start to ask some questions they might go into silence beneath this silence is safety vulnerability trust and deep in it truth so in some sense this is human and this is humanity. And in humanity, we can see that this person represents all of the other people in the sphere of humanity itself. So once we come out of this space, once you've questioned and silent, um, you might debate, you might discuss, you might deliberate, and eventually you will get to dialogue. And when you get to dialogue, you will get to learn. And once a lot of people in this space learn together, what you're going to see is cultural evolution. And when we look at it from an integral perspective, this becomes the me, how I show up in the world. This becomes the I, who I deeply am. This is the it, the system, the thing we can talk about. And this becomes the we, the collective. And if you want to look at a scale, this is IQ, this is EQ, this is SQ and this is DQ and this is how we understand